back, guys, to another NFL Talk Show video. Today, it's episode 10 of NFL Talk Show Season 3. And today, we're going to be doing the news, our Week 11 picks, our NFL awards, I guess, for the week. And we're going to do the news for next week's episode. So, let's go to the news. For the news for this week, we have some crazy news. So, to start off, we have Nanaka Sue. He's going to the Eagles for a one-year deal, and that's pretty good, but he's 35 years old. We also have Linval Joseph signing with the Philadelphia Eagles. He's kind of old, too, but he does fill those gaps. He was just with the Chargers and the Giants. Okay, now we have Cooper Cup. Um, he's going to be missing some weeks because he got injured during the Cardinals game. And the Rams did lose that game, so they're going to be missing their number one receiver. And also, this Sunday, the Browns and Bills game is expected to have six feet of snow. And that's taller than some the two starting running backs, Nick Chubb and Devin Singletary. So, they actually are moving the game to Detroit, um, the Lions Stadium. So... They are not going to be playing in Buffalo because it's supposed to be six feet of snow. That's crazy. That's taller than me. That's like, that's like up to here to me. But yeah, so that's the weather in Buffalo. Now we're going to our week 11 picks. So for week 11, we have some pretty good games. Um, Yeah, lots in the air right now for the playoffs. And probably, I'll say... I'll say, like, in three weeks, we'll be doing the playoffs um, stuff. But here we go. They kick it off. We have Thursday Night Football that's going on right now. Titans, Packers. I'm going to go Titans. Um, Packers. They won last week because they beat the Cowboys. Because they're, they went, the Cowboys went for fourth and whatever, and they didn't get it. So I'm going to go Titans. Eagles, Colts. After the Eagles losing to the Commanders, like... Uh, they're going to win this one. Panthers, Ravens. Don't even need to talk about that one. Um, Bears and Falcons. Um, This is going to be an interesting game. Both teams are, I would like to say, second place, second, third place on their in their division. So, it's, actually, it's probably going to be an important game for both teams. But I'm going to go with the Bears because... They're the Justin Fields has been doing really well, so I think he'll do well. Jets, Patriots, I think they're going to split this one. Oh, my God. <clears throat> Sorry about that. The Jets and Patriots. Um, I think the Patriots are going to win. Um, they won the, Jets won the first time. I think Patriots are going to win. Rams, Saints. Both crappy teams, but I'm going to go with the Rams because they don't have Cooper Cup, and... I think they're, the Rams are going to win. Okay, this is in Detroit, not in Buffalo. So, Browns, Bills, in Detroit. I'm going to go Bills because it's not going to be too cold, but it's they're going to win. Lions, Giants. Lions won two weeks in a row. We're going to make it three weeks in a row. That's going to be my upset of the week. We have the Commanders and Texans. Michael Commanders, Taylor Heineke, has been bowling out. I think he'll be winning that game for them. We have the Raiders and the Broncos as our 4, four o'clock games. Um, both teams are garbage, so I'm going to go with the Broncos. Cowboys and Vikings, really good game right here. Um, I'm going to go Vikings after beating the Bills last week. I think they're going to take care of business. This game... Bengals Steelers. Both teams are in color rush. The white helmets and the black and gold jerseys. Love the love both uniforms for both teams. But I'm gonna go with the Steelers. Four o'clock game, 425. Steelers are gonna win that one. Chiefs and the Chargers. Sunday night football. Again, I don't know why. It was supposed to be the Steelers here, but the Steelers suck, I guess. But the Chiefs and Chargers, Chargers just, they're not that good. 49ers, Cardinals. This is actually an important game for both teams. 
because currently they're second and third place in their division. And if the Cardinals win, they could have the upper hand against the 49ers. And I think the Cardinals are going to win. Um, the 49ers need a loss right now, so, yeah. And our two bye team, or four bye teams we have, the Seahawks, Dolphins, Bucks, and Jaguars. So these are our picks for this week. Now let's go to our awards. So for our awards this week, we have our Offense and Defense Player of the Week for Week 10. So let's kick it off. We have Justin Jefferson for Offense Player of the Week. He balled out against the Bills. That crazy catch, the one-handed catch. That was pretty nice. I was watching that game after the Steelers were destroying the Saints. But, like, it was a good game. For defensive player of the week, you know, we had to give it to my boy, Alex Highsmith, Pittsburgh Steeler. He, had, he balled out, got two sacks, um, strip, stripped the ball from the quarterback in Dalton. And, yeah, he did pretty well. So these are our players for this week. Um, next week, we're going to be doing the Thanksgiving players. Or whatever. <laughs> so now let's go to the end of NFL talk show. So for the end of NFL talk show, next week's the Thanksgiving special. And sorry, guys, for not posting last week. Daylight saving time kind of messed me up. Because, like, when I got home from school, it was, like, like. I'll say like four o'clock ish, and then like it was a little bit sunny out, and then like an hour later, dark, and like I get so tired sometimes, and yeah, I was I was falling asleep a little bit earlier. So for this week or next week, um, we're gonna be doing the Thanksgiving special on Tuesday, and so you're gonna get kind of like a quick turnaround for NFL talk show, but this Thanksgiving special. Will be one part. So last year I did two parts. We we could do two parts, but I don't know. I still have to think. It might it might be two parts. Maybe we'll have just have the Thanksgiving games, and then we'll do the regular regular picks. I guess I guess gotta think about that. But so next week's Thanksgiving special. Um, nothing really changing in my background because I don't have that much Thanksgiving stuff. But Christmas is all around the corner. And I do want to have the NFL Talk Show Christmas special. I never did that before. So, yeah. So, probably in after, like in two weeks from now, you're going to see some Christmas stuff in the NFL Talk Show. And thank you guys for hitting 200 subscribers for me. Um, I'm pretty happy. And thank you guys. And make sure to keep subscribing. Helps me out. And thank you guys for watching the Call of Duty videos. Because they've been doing really well. I got like... A thousand views on one of them. So thank you guys for watching. Those videos. Um, but make sure to keep watching NFL Talk Show. That's what I enjoy the most. I enjoy making YouTube videos. But I like doing NFL Talk Show. Because it's actually something I love. I love football. So thank you guys for watching this week. For NFL Talk Show. Um, I'll be back next week. I'm going to see you guys on Tuesday. And see you guys later. Peace.